You know, there's just so many stories out there about how this turns out so differently, and I am so incredibly grateful that she's here. It's a mother's worst nightmare, finding out that her daughter never made it back from school that day. And one woman in Eureka almost had that happen Thursday morning. Celine Carr tells me her daughter's walk to school was not like it usually is. And she spoke exclusively to North Coast News about this horrifying ordeal so that others can be on the lookout. And I just wanted to be in her presence and be grateful that she's here with me today. A caring and worried mother, Celine Carr, holds her daughter Stephanie tight. This after a terrifying walk to school at St. Bernard's early Thursday morning. A car pulled up and gentleman asked her, hey, do you want to ride? And she said, no, I do not. Very firm. And he said, do you want to make 200 bucks? And she said no. Celine says then Stephanie ran to school for safety, telling her mother about it later that day. Um, and I told her, I said, I am going to call the police and report this. And she said, OK, are you ready for the information? And she gave me the most wonderful description. It appears that uh, an individual, uh, has a Hawaiian male, approximately 28 years of age, and an older model, boxy SUV, cream in color. Captain Brian Stevens of the Eureka Police Department says they're searching for that suspect. It's going to be hard to pinpoint that exact vehicle and that person, uh, but we will be in the area when school resumes on Tuesday after the holiday. Until then, Celine says the scary thought of what if still looms, taking advantage of every moment she has with her child. Did you, you, you told me you stayed home with her. Mm -hmm. uh, why did you stay home with her? because I'm grateful that she's here. This could have turned out so different. And I love my daughter so much. And I'm just so grateful that she was protected and, and safe. And I would have been a nervous wreck at work today. She hasn't left my side. We gone. we went to the store and did some things earlier today. Celine says thanks to her caring friends, she trusts Stephanie will be safe. It's gonna be difficult going back to work tomorrow but um, she has people that will be with her. And now she wants other parents in Eureka to know. Don't be afraid to have these conversations with your kids. It is very real. A reality that Celine doesn't want any other parent to face. I would much rather my kids um, step with a little trepidation and fear, but hyper awareness so that they do come home every night like my daughter has. Now, here's the suspect description from Captain Stevens. EPD is telling us he's described as a Hawaiian man in his late 20s, a brown complexion. He has brown hair and a short stubble beard, possibly even driving an off-white boxy sports SUV. And they say he was last seen near Henderson and C Street in Eureka. Celine says the principal, Paul Shanahan, sent out an email warning parents about this possible suspect. And Captain Stevens says there will be a patrol out Tuesday when students get back to school.